Welcome to Crypto Dex World. Need a new operating system? This is Kathir. What is going on, everyone? If there was a way to connect people through the power of a free scalable blockchain, would you be excited? This is what the Kathir Project is doing, an operating system to connect people, connecting everyone everywhere through decentralized protocols based on a Linux operating system. We're going to jump into what this is. But before we get started, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. Please do your own research. Due diligence. Don't invest in anything you're not willing to lose. So yes, Kathir is an amazing project right here. This is free. It's secure. It's scalable. And it is a decentralized system based on a Linux-based operating system and powered by BNB, KAH, and the operating system's utility token. And that is on right here. As we can see, the NFT marketplace is also live as well. And we can see the project is a limited company. It's free, it's secure. And the interesting thing about this is this is a vision to offer a perfectly integrated operating system where users' daily work will depend on it collaboratively without a central authority. So maybe you're using Windows right now. Maybe you're using Mac. Maybe you're using another operating system. What if there's an operating system completely decentralized that you work together and achieve an amazing goal? And they believe the only specific and profitable approach to create a large project is to focus on long-term development, and that will expand and achieve goals, including the operating system and the token, and the team is putting huge effort into that. So yes, this is a total operating system right here. Not just the concept of it, but a huge operating system that you can use and one thing is, if you're tired of maybe Windows being clunky, if you're tired of issues with Apple, or if you want a new Linux distribution other than Ubuntu, well, Kathir OS might just be your thing. So the, mar the NFT marketplace is now live, and you can buy all the contents of Kathir OS, avatars, powers, energies, applications, games, DLCs, subscription plans, features, and even virtual items in the form of NFT. They're all on chain digital goods, and all NFT prices on the marketplace will be listed on this token. And after launch, the NFT prices on the marketplace were listed in the native KAH token, with the revenues being used to support the project liquidity. So let's get into the operating system, a decentralized OS with open source, no central authority. All members and decisions and votes are recorded and enforced and transparent through online integrated systems inside of the operating system, which is very, very interesting because only members can decide the future of the development. It's like a DAO integrated with an OS and is completely decentralized. And that's why they have a vision to offer a perfectly integrated OS where daily work will be dependent on collaborative efforts, but there's no central authority. And they're actually going to disrupt existing organizations. Think of Microsoft Windows, Apple, other even other Linux distributions, and solve other OS issues and combine all the good features, actual ownership through their tokens and NFT. So the KH, their token, is what's going to be behind this ecosystem. And that unit denominates transactions for services. And it will be introduced here as a default method of payment in the US. Account leveling, voting, internal transactions, NFT stores, subscriptions. Everything you're going to do in this ecosystem will use this native token. And holder spend KH while using the OS. So think of like Brave Browser. You get the Brave, you get the native token while just using it or basic attention token while using Brave. Think about this. You're using an operating system and you're getting paid. You're getting actual, hold, you're a holder of it, and you actually get some KH while using the operating system. How awesome is that? As you can see, the access, the holder spent KH while using the actual operating system. That's, that's really exciting. Also, the governance token allows holders to participate in governance decision of the project using NFTs. When was the last time if you had some windows or put bought a windows operating system you could say i want to decide the direction of windows or apple you can't but you can decide here if you hold the native token also holders can gain passive revenues by just holding their own native token and the role of foundation is to support the ecosystem of the project we can see the main parts of the ecosystem as we talked about the nft marketplace there'll be a wallet to hold it so not just an operating system not just their native token but a wallet the operating system itself and developer support there's a huge amount of stuff on the roadmap. So many things are happening. They have the token created, verification, launching social medias, the white paper, the core project. Then they also have updating the main website, LP locked forever, marketing security agreements, the project team expanding, CoinGecko listing, Certec audit, the exchange listing, starting the voting system, Coinbase as well. 
Lunar Crush. So that's going to be huge. Then they also have the security audit, the wallet available coming. And then we're going to get the debit card. Yes, there'll actually even be a debit card as well. Again, listed on the top 30 cryptocurrency exchanges and launching the Kathir OS as well, producing laptop devices, mobile phones. This is a whole thing. This isn't just one aspect. This is an operating system. It'll be mobile phones, OSs. There'll be a card. They will be, everything will be integrated into this right here. They also have the ecosystem of the global ID for wallet applications, games, and voting platform. The mall where individuals, businesses can discover how to sell and buy items using their native token, KAH. The marketplaces we talked about, the cloud, the store, and the wallet. And we can see the tokenomics right here with the Kathir token, KAH, the token supply, the pre-sale price, the price afterwards. It's on BSC. We have soft cap and hard cap and the whole ecosystem here. There's so much here to check out. This is absolutely amazing. But we have the docs, the support, the white paper, the audit, the NFT marketplace, and even the token distribution. We can see the pre-sale here, the backup, ecosystem, marketing team, initial liquidity, as well as a 5% tax fee from each transaction. But it's going to be redistributed to the holders. One will be sent to burn address and 3% to liquidity, as well as 95 remaining to buy or sell. We can see the documentation here, as well as the team development and the visionary behind it, Hassan Elwa as well as the information about their company and ways to get in touch. And they have an extensive amount of social media, Telegram, Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, Reddit, YouTube, Instagram, and Medium. And their latest news is right here. That is the Kathir Project. Huge project, amazing stuff, the operating system, and everything to come in this short video. And what's exciting with this is there's going to be so much here. Are you interested in using an operating system to connect with other people where you collaboratively create amazing things without a central authority? I would be interested to know that. With that being said, let's take a look at their NFT marketplace and some social media. And we have the Kathir NFT marketplace right here, which is powered by the project operating system to connect people. You can actually buy their token right here and you can see the different NFT avatars as well as the different NFT categories right here. There's a lot of cool stuff to choose from. And they have the lowest price NFTs right here. These are super cheap and they're super realistic. I love this. I also like the fantasy ones right here. Very, very cool. This is a nicely organized marketplace and the NFTs are absolutely beautiful. So definitely check this out. Browse the marketplace. Have some fun and know that there's some amazing things coming as well. And you can check out the Kathir project right here. Kathir underscore project. They're blowing up in followers. Over 4,000 followers. 4,032 followers because people want that awesome operating system. They love that NFT marketplace. They can see that they are doing some huge things right here. And they know that Kathir is absolutely going to blow up. Take it by storm. There's going to be a big disruption for other operating systems out there. As we can see, this is a blockchain agnostic, decentralized, community-driven, Linux-based operating system. What that simply means is you are in control, not the big names, not Microsoft Windows, not Apple, not other big players you are finally in control with this awesome linux operating system are you interested in it i would love to know so if you enjoyed this review smash that like button hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell to know when i post more videos if you have questions or comments let me know down below thanks for watching catch you in the next